Alrighty then. Ladies and gentlemen, and all gamers in between, it's a pleasure to bring you the first uh, event in what is going to be a series of events spanning across the next three months. This is the Exert Archives, a joint project between the little old me and the Dawn of Revival guys, Leah and Answer. And uh, speaking of the devil, we've got the man, the myth, the legend himself with us on the mic today. I am. I'm on the mic. It's been, uh, it's been, I think, five months since the last time I uh, held a tournament on my own, and that was plus all. I think it's been a good eight to nine months since the last uh, Exit event. Pretty much since Strive's release, we haven't had anything Exit related. I'm so happy to be back. It's going to be sick. Yeah, you and me both. I I do love myself some good, good old Exert content, and I've missed it so much as well. It is, <sighs> this is actually the best. Um, would you actually, as the sort of mastermind of this project, uh, mm. like to give a little synopsis on what the Exert archive is and what kind of events can we expect over the next three months? Gladly. Um... Uh, right. Um, so for the next three months, exactly, so February, March, and April, we'll be having uh, these first to five rotations as well as um, brackets and tournaments. Uh, first to five every first and last Saturday of the month, uh, one monthly tournament and around the middle of the month. And uh, every set played, every match played will count towards a uh, score that in the end will uh, th that we will decide the winner on in the end. And I think that's about it. We have yeah. a match, you know. If you want to contribute to that, go ahead. There's a bunch of things you can do on the side as well. If you don't want, to, you know, if you can't or don't want to like pay yourself, you can do a little thingies and add a little thing to the prize. Um, that's about it. Yeah, I guess if, if you if you want to sort of uh, donate to the final pot, there's a there's a match arena link which should work, I think, um, with the exclamation point X A command in the chat if you want to view that. Yeah, Thank you I... for the match. <laughs> there you go. There it that is. That one. Beautiful. Yeah, I gotta try my best here to mentally prepare for the sets being FT5 instead of my usual FT7. I am so sorry to throw you out of whack, but, uh, <laughs> but... I really wanted to incorporate as many players as possible. Yeah, we're we're potentially looking at a very decent amount of matchups every event, and since you know it's this league kind of format with points involved, we obviously want to offer everyone as many opportunities as possible to play whenever. Hell yeah. Um, and to be able to fit as many matchups on the card. Like, holy shit, this is, what, eight matchups for a single event? <laughs> that's that's more than it's more than I've ever casted on a single event, minus, like, tournament brackets. My sincerest apologies also go out to Rika Mi. I am, I am so sorry. It's my fault. Already sleeping in chat. Anyway. Uh, let's see, so we have this command as well, players. Uh, as far as the scheduling goes, uh, initially the Pinku versus Trigger matchup will be delayed slightly to stall time for Trigger. So we're looking at playing, uh, I believe, Toxic Jam versus Sailor Steam Eno first. Mm -hmm. All right, let me... Go ahead and ping them in the Discord real quick if you haven't already. Yeah, that would be that would be Talk very helpful. Alright. Toxic's already raring to go. Hell yeah.
All right, coming back to sort of, or making like a sort of a comeback to the excerpt scene, there's a, there's a fair amount of players who I sort of know from back in the day and fair amount of players who seem like relatively new. Um, right. I know Sailor Steam from actually, I think they've played during my events on, on a lot of other events. Um, yeah, she's been around since the Plus R beta, I think, at least. Uh, I know if her playing ABBA might have switched. Mm -hmm. I'm not too sure. Was uh, um, playing around with Eno as well, I know, and Plus R. Do we know Ziz? I um, Ziz and Chan, but yeah. <laughs> I, uh, I do know you, Ziz. Amazing. Yeah, I am I am not that senile. Pot player. I, don't, I only know Psychedelic Pet, the soul player. Oh yeah, that's... Oh, that, I, I guess that, that's, uh, that's another thing that we should probably mention, that you are not in fact character locked for, for these events, oh, yeah. so... Yeah, no, feel free to switch around all you want. If if Stale wants to bust out the Raven, he is free to do so, but I doubt he will. Yeah, not like a lot of players in uh, in Guilty Gear would usually go for their sub characters. It's 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 really hard in a game like this where like knowledge is power, matchup knowledge is everything. To yeah, there's, there's so much to learn and find and hone that. Focusing on two characters is pretty difficult. Yeah, even if even if you have like sort of a matchup advantage with your pocket character, it's it's really hard to utilize. And that will that's an interesting question that will probably come to come into play with especially a psychedelic pets set later. Because they do have a couple of characters that are ready to be played. Although Pet is yeah. obviously a we know him as a Potemkin player, Potemkin main. But this match up here, so Jam versus you know, it's upcoming. Yeah. Um, I think this matchup on paper is probably not one of Jam's favorites. Um, you wouldn't usually really consider you know to have like the best footsies, but she mm. has deceptively good buttons for certain ranges, and Jam really needs to get in there uh, before she gets started. And another for unfortunate thing for Jam is that I believe Eno doesn't care all that much about, you know, her parries during set play because of how the multi-hitting note covers your advances. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the, the note works really well against parry. Um, not not too sure how how well uh, Eno, quote-unquote, uh, the, the Hubbard Ash safe jumps work against parry. I would assume she's decently safe. Yeah, like you know, you know, usually known for her safe jumps, but they're they're they work a little different. I guess if you if you don't get a setup with a note, then sure. Um, jumps parry usually screws up safe jump attempts quite a bit. You do need to add more layers to your game plan. Mm -hmm. You can just can't just uh, go for medies or safe jumps willy nilly, because jam does have options against that. Okay, Sailor's rebooting, because uh, he's running into some issues with Steam. Good ol' Steam, good ol' Exide. The machine. usual. <laughs> at, least, at least it's not Tuesday. Yeah, it's... Are there Exide events on Tuesdays? I think... I don't think there are. I guess for a good reason, because it's yeah. it's always that day when uh, when Gaben has a has a day off, in a way. The Steam Heavens throw a fit and kick out specifically Exon. In terms of Strive, though, I, I think Strive has been having some rough days uh, <laughs> during like big event stage, such as Sundays, recently. Mm. But yeah, about these, I guess, quotations, old games, sort of like Exert, um, 
we we do have it, it's it's so great that we still have decent sized devoted communities for for all the old games in fact like before before i was saying like holy shit my dream is finally coming true i can <laughs> first on friday stream acpr then on yeah. saturday stream exert and then sunday stream uh strive right. yeah what a timeline the dream is real guilty gear lives no matter what form exert specifically somehow undying <laughs> the last of the delay games and it still somehow has what right now i think four different events going on Mm -hmm. uh, the, the 2BCU Challenger League, which is starting soon, uh, organized by Stale. Uh, Squid Guy's still doing the bi-weeklies, I think. We got this stuff. I think there's something else. God. Anyway, we're getting into it. And Sailor's playing Soul instead of Eno, which I can respect. You know, I might want to might wanna try to out-monkey the monkey. Yeah, that's always an option. Ooh. Okay. Straight into it. Oh. What? <laughs> I guess that's not the most favorable point to have a uh, lag spike. Oh, this is. The oh. Ooh. It's. Oh. <laughs> I don't know what to say. <laughs> we're, we're getting the, the full exit dose today. Alright, looking a little better now. Oh my god, clashes with the DP! Oh gosh, this is... <laughs> this is... The, oh, this is really wonky. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. We've been stale in chat saying this might be a performance issue rather than netcode. Yeah, usually in... It, it... It, it, it looks really weird because like delay usually doesn't look like this. It's it's the classic when one person has like FPS issues. It's it's mm. going to be reflected in yeah. in weird ways. Looks kind of now though. All right. It, it seems to be working. Nice. Confirm. Into DP. Here we go. Oh, that's. Go. Does it work this time? Ah, uh, mostly. Yeah. Uh, I can see some lag spikes. Oh, oh. Nice, gets a punish on the self-stun. Oh, is that gonna... Yeah, not gonna power through, but still trades. I guess that not worked. too bad for... <gasps> okay, it doesn't quite kill. Come flim wire C. And we're uh, looking at gameplay. Okay, base CDP. Doesn't quite kill. Gets a knockdown. There you go. Oh gosh, I bet. Missing the combo there. Ah! <laughs> that chunk cans, like, bet that was gonna be something else, but. That's first one for our Sailor's team. Okay, that was an experience. Let's see if they <laughs> have anything to say about this or if they just keep going. If they're both okay with it, no, they're not. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, yeah. I don't. I don't blame you. I <laughs> wouldn't really love to be on either end of that. Wow. That was something. No. <laughs> yeah. Exit running properly is uh. Something. Oh, potentially Sarah didn't check their settings before playing. It, it does really make a little bit of a difference. Um... No? I guess she doesn't have anything to say. Simply right. switching to Eno. Alright. All right. Well, this one goes on the list of uh, connections to memorize, maybe not to match, if this is uh, at all due to connectivity rather than performance. This is looking much more fluid. Oh, Japan stage as well. Good old. 
Like fishing for hits. Jump 2k. Ooh, still gets a follow up. That's not gonna be on even hit. Very plus for Jam. Ooh, we can't hit in the corner though. This is a good start. Ah, misses the combo. Good side switch. Dives under with stroke the big tree. Wake up stroke. Oh, Ooh, that should be good. I think, yeah, they committed to a button. Hasn't been able to really pin down Toxic so far with any of the set play. Oh, nice. Lots of meter Actually, for Toxic. What's, yeah. the, what's the, the frame advantage on the top of Puff Ball? Um, I just saw a single Puff Ball that is 6H. <laughs> I don't know if that... If that is a, a legit reset. The heavy one at least is a very plus. Oh, the heavy one is well plus, okay. It's kind of like, you know, stroke the big tree, the S, the, the, mm -hmm. the lighter version minus, but the, uh, the heavier version very plus, if I'm not mistaken. Nice. Oh, drops the combo. Oh, there we go again. Yep, press 5k. I saw that. Okay, okay. Uh, not close enough to the corner. That's sad. Again, I wonder if... I wonder if Toxic is missing putting something on Wake Up there, doing like a really weird super jump here and there. Uh, it's super jump back as well, so you wouldn't expect it to be like a missing for TK region. Oh. Right, hold this. Oh, oh. but... Ends up pushing Sailor out yeah. of that. Eugen YRCs into the success. Alright, finding a way in. Now in the okay, corner, big chance. Overhead. Yeah, the jump 2k for Jam, even on hit. It's so good. It's, it's sober, of... but also it's the uh, kind of iffy advantage-wise. Oh, classic! You may just get thrown out of it because guilty gear exists. Yeah, it's like you. Oh, this should this should hit though. Yes. Yeah. We could all, you know, reversal super. That's one more hit. Oh. All players with a lot of resources. Yeah, spend it. I, I think I tried. Yeah, toxic tried to go for a burst bait there with that. Command dash, but Sailor's team didn't buy it. And that's how it. That's how it goes. It's it's the burst bait RP as is 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 very interesting. Sometimes you can get like really big rewards out of reading a burst, but sometimes you just end up sort of throwing away your momentum, and then they're mm -hmm. still holding the burst afterwards. Yeah. Like arguably, if, if, even if they do burst and you get bursted, you still get a little bit of value out of that exchange because the burst will be spent. Yeah. All right, opts to burst the cart charge. Not too bad. Oh, oh there's a catch in. That's unfortunate. Oh, nice okay. intercepting I that, that Toxic wanted to jump out. Because that note, you can guide it pretty much any any direction you want. This should be good again. Yeah. Get a knockdown note. There's the burst out. Keep sailing in the corner. Doesn't work out though. Nice move. Oh, the dead angle as well. I didn't quite manage to pick up the jump the counter hit. It's looking slightly chunky again. Okay, toxic safe on this one. 6H into the corner. Oh, uh, uh. there it is again. Uh... That one might have been a uh, misinput, um, you know, uh, instant J2K. We accidentally hitting down forward and getting mm -hmm. the input. Okay, knockdown. Ooh, big one, here we go. Ah, misses the instant there, Dash. Okay, 2D jump cancels.
Yeah, this is one of the things that Toxic struggles with is keeping momentum going after getting a knockdown. He he tends to just uh, kind of stand there and let too much time Ooh. pass. That was uh, questionable. I think yeah that. Silverstein probably wanted to go for a yellow RC there, or some kind of an RC after after mm. that exchange, but, you know, sometimes you end up inputting an extra button in there, and that's an IK input. Mm. It's definitely a mistake that yours truly does make as well from time to time. <laughs> right. Ooh! Blue burst goes unpunished. That was interesting. It looked kind of like a combo drop, but ended up being a 200 IQ burst bait. Right. <laughs> I mean, in this business, we, we do take those. No, of course we do. Okay, okay. Reinforced game. Ooh, reset. Uh, Champ does have some really interesting and destructive resets if you sort of drop your combo and then try to get a counter hit with a puffball. Yeah, she, she has some really... Really, uh, painful counter hits. Oh! That should have killed, I think. Oh, okay. We'll take that. Alright, searching for that one hit. Just whipping barely. Okay, high note. Stays on the ground this time. And we get the reversal throw. Toxic missing the jump counts on that. On that. A lot of these uh, random stray hits are not being confirmed properly. That's kind of understandable. Both these are lightweight characters, and if you catch your opponent like airborne or some really obscure position, it can be kind of difficult to flash confirm yeah, into the proper yeah. combo. Oh, like for example, there no. earlier. Like, Toxic was expecting to get that hit on a grounded opponent, but Sailor Steam was just barely in the air. Yo! Oh, that kills, okay. Street Fighter confirms? One All hit right. into Super? We get the, the 2S Super, okay. The Eno crouching medium kick. Ooh, there oh, it is. There we go. Didn't have a note to cover that up, so parry is an option. Oh, nice check there. Yeah, there's a startup okay. between the command dash and the puff ball again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, and the throw. Ooh, beautiful. Okay, I think Sailor's uh, figuring out ways to fight her way out of pressure. For that one okay. more decisive hit. Lots of small ones traded back and forth. Ooh, that might be... Oh, but the missing symbol there too! The oh. command grab! Oh, oh again! No. <laughs> <laughs> she really wants this. Okay. Plus no, frames. Oh, there oh, we go. Oh, this now. No, I didn't press. Just block time. Yeah, Toxic was probably worried about chip there. So opted to FD, but that sort of increased the plus frames even more. Of that mm. Eno's reversal super. It's a pretty decent yeah. reversal super if the opponent is not in a position to throw you. Eno's supers in general are really good. Yeah. It's like Eno, Johnny, Sin. Those would definitely be my top picks for the best characters for their useful overdrives in the game. Oh, uh, Leo. Yeah, Leo as well. Pretty much any character that can combo after their super will be able to build back so much meter. I think Jam also has decently uh, strong supers. Mm -hmm. Isn't the, uh, the super puff ball zero? I'm not sure. Uh, it's actually plus. If you I beat, it's zero. But I mean, Jam buttons oh, I, afterwards. I, I meant, I meant uh, zero startup post flash. Where it's oh, one, one um, of those deals where you, if you aren't blocking during the flash, uh, you can't block after it. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Similar to Eno's air super. And I think uh, Chip Kick Super, Ansys Kick Super as well, and Leo's uh, Windmill. Oh, okay, nice. OTG Puff will do it. Alright, 
finds a way in. Not quite into a knockdown though. Jump 2k, working as an air to air. <laughs> Ooh, there we go. Ah, but the. Yeah, not able to literally. Uh, you, you really gotta finish up your combos if you want that. That good old hard knockdown into set yeah. play. Getting a knockdown with Jam without cards is a little, a little iffy if you really want damage. Yeah, although Jam's might, like... Might be better off to just go into a parry PP. Oh, oh does he have... it? No, no, just barely not enough time. Oh, see, so... it works out anyway. Yeah, it's a little ambitious to uh, go for the IK <laughs> finish on, on red IK. I respect it. You might as well. Yeah, bonus points for sure. Ooh, VCL. Hitting us an oh, there, there we go. go. Nice escape. Schmoves out of the corner using the dial. Okay, get the card. Do it again. Nice. nice. There you go. And Almost full combo. That's unfortunate. Oh. oh you pressed the button. Uh, uh, uh. You're not supposed to do that. Exclamation mark victims, I like it. <laughs> classical, <laughs> classical command from a couple of years ago. <laughs> Alright, find the throw. Again, I wonder what it is, but like Sailor... Sailor Steam's note setups on the Oki haven't quite been on point. He's mostly uh, looking to catch jumps from what I've seen. But, uh, you know, that, that obviously makes it so she doesn't really have the advantage in going in. Oh, there you go. Alright, good. Finding a way out. Toxic. Ooh, I think that's... yeah, that's gonna hit. Man, that reversal super is so good. But here we go though, Toxic with a lot of meter. Oh, small punish, but... Doesn't quite get to capitalize on that. And the Dragon Kick on Whiff. Um, I think in, in this game you can't cancel it on Whiff, thank god. But on block, you <laughs> you still have the spe like kick special into kick special RPS that you have on jam. Yeah. Ooh, ooh nice! Back in the corner. Okay. Ooh, buff ball into buff ball. Here we go. Oh, that was a reset. Ah, nice. doesn't get the parry PP. Oh. Okay. All right. We go. Let's see if we get the party started. Good burst. Okay. Burst her back into the corner. Gets cornered himself. Oh, again. The command crap miss inputs. I wonder. I wonder what that is. That is That's unfortunate. Super. It's three three. Alright, pretty even so far. Yeah. It really comes down to, I think, the player who's able to more consistently land the the small conversions. It's like in, in, in sets like this when you have difficulties landing maybe those optimal BMBs. It, yeah, you get a lot of consistent knockdowns. Yeah, you can get a lot of value for just like quotation baby combos. Just being able to get as much value out of every touch as you can. Oh, nice! Is that do heavy still check that stroke the big tree? Nice. Oh. It gets a lot of damage through. Ah, oh, but oh. that puffball super has been such a oh reversal. Nice Ooh, okay. Ooh, nice Ooh, backdash. Back is the dive. Nice. 
Parry. Oh, oh the second hit. And again, the puffball super mad. Yeah, that's that's been such a massive uh constant like source of damage for for toxic is sailor yeah. sailor's team has been pressing buttons on wake up pretty actively and that's that's the dream scenario for milk that damage out of that puff ball super yeah like even though that super is oh, no. plus on block it's like it's not like if, if the opponent blocks it it's not <laughs> optimal what is it we are taking with no fd no yeah, reads it again. Sailor Rose, or Sailor Steam still gets out of the corner. Good check there. Oh, okay. Yeah, nice. Reinforced get killed for the knockdown. Ooh. There you go. Frame trapping into 6P. Ooh. So even once Not again. Nice. Oh. Back back oh. Okay. Yeah, I get the knockdown. Okay. Ah, uh, doesn't space stuff okay correctly. That's another. Ah, okay. uh, same drop once again. Ooh, big counter hit. Oh no! Sailor's team still has the burst though. This might wave. Mm -hmm. Nice tech buttons. Oh my god, it's a slug fest. Who's gonna come out on top? It's the dive again, the overhead. You gotta react to that pretty fast. That is a common theme with Eno. But to balance it out, if you block it, it's usually gonna be fairly minus. Most cases yeah. you can get a throw punish. If it hits really high or if you get an IB, you might even be able to squeeze in some light buttons as a starter. Toxic has been uh, trying and and mostly succeeding in, in parrying the dive. But, uh, you know, it's kind of risky, especially with how fast it moves. It's pretty difficult to time. Oh, nice okay. pickup. I like the pickup. Uh, the parry PK. It's yet again. Yeah, especially unfortunate when you drop the combo so that they, like, sort of get vacuumed out of the corner as well. Yeah. With Jam kind of lowering her box with that. Ooh, nice! Low profiling under with a 2k! Alright, burst towards the corner. The Toxic has such a nice position here. Bursts are out of the equation. And again, that's such a recurring theme for Sailor's theme. What is the, what is the uh, input for that command grab anyway? Uh, it's 2 1 for H. I don't know what else you would do with Eno. Yeah, then. I don't have enough Eno knowledge to sort of... I, I don't think she has any other commands for that. Could be a hard rate on jump out, maybe? Yeah, maybe. Alright, just flying around. <laughs> We're diving. <laughs> kind of saying like, alright. Stop doing what you're doing and block. If not, you might risk getting hit here. Your excitement is building up, don't worry. Oh, Reversal Super. Didn't press. Okay, Toxic's becoming more patient. Ah. But again, the Puffball Super. And the. Oh. Okay. All right. He, he kind of stood still there for a second. I guess, like, I guess Toxic like, saw like a mile away <laughs> that that super was coming, and I, I'll just I'll just wait here till it expires. Oh, the HCO. Oh, Match the pop off. Okay. Sailor Steam is on set point here, and declaring, "I am oh, going to head. take this home." Oh. Two footsies. <laughs> footsies. <laughs> 
There you go. Footsie is the word you would not expect from the commentator's mouth when these two characters are on screen. I will call Footsies whenever a dive kick hits a neutral. <laughs> Ooh, goes under the wave. Yeah, can we up? And again! Yeah, presses 2k on like everything that was. That's Sailor's theme. Very close to a finish here. This could be the last one. Gold burst? Gold burst, okay. Now what? What are we using that juice on? Oh, oh, there it is! <laughs> They've been trying to land that for the whole set. And <laughs> as a finishing gambit. Oh. Uh. Wow, that's right. a flashy finish. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> Alright, after that super close <laughs> bout Sailor's team, takes a couple of rounds in a row, comes out victorious. That was nice, I like that. Woo! Okay. What do we got next? Um, is Trigger present? Uh, I think so, yeah. So Trigger is available, yeah. so we we can play Trigger <laughs> versus <laughs> Pinku next. Oh, Toxic said the connection was pretty bad. Uh, yeah, yeah. Okay, we have Pinku and, and Trigger in the room. That is Pinku on the left and Trigger on the right. <laughs> the Indian call center guy, Steve Name. <laughs> I love those names. Oh, Pinku's on Axel now? I saw, yeah, yeah. I... <laughs> Oh no, no, she's moving to Seoul, I think. Yeah. Yeah, so I, I saw in chat uh, just a second ago, um, both Stale and Leapfrog offered up uh, 20 euros for Pinku if she uh, uh, IK's trigger in the set. Ooh, I like that. Let's go. So yeah. Here we go. Heaven or hell. Duel. Duel. One. One. Let's rock. All right, Soul. One step right, Stan. You know. Okay, let's see this. Get your knockdown into the corner. TK dive kick. Ooh, what an IB on the way down. Ooh, that's gonna hurt. Well, Fafnir tries to bait a burst, doesn't work. Trigger staying patient. Okay, IAD combos. Okay, I like this. Ah. It was a little too close with that gun flame, but the right There's idea. Low. Okay. On oh, the DP. Oh. oh. <laughs> yeah. Diving on was That jump was a burst spit on, on Pinky's side. Bigger burst later. Whiffs anyway, that's sad. Ooh, I like RC. RC. I mean, it's looking a little crunchy. Ooh. Oh, okay. Footsies. 5k, yeah. Actual footsies. That's dangerous as well. If you get counter hit by that 6 heavy, that's almost a round over if you don't have a burst. Yeah, that's risky. Okay, throw him in, throw into the corner. Ooh, triangle dash setups, I like it. Oh, dive YRC. Okay. Oh, that was an interesting cross-up setup. Ooh, here's Pinker's chance to bring it back. We have the meter. Fafnir, just not quite enough. There's oh, I, I, I like the uh, dash on the HCL there. Yeah, really nice quality Old of burst. life thing for Sol. Having that. Oh, she, she wants this IK. She <gasps> wants the IK so bad. She wants it so bad. One more touch. One more touch. No, okay, no more IKs. That's it. No, just take the round. Oh, oh unless... drops it. Drops uh -oh. it. Oh, the second! 
What? <laughs> I think I think she got uh, a got an IB on that six heavy, so there was a pretty sizable gap between the hits. <laughs> Died on purpose. We're resetting for more rounds. Oh wow, jumpy as a challenge against BB. Okay, he got the IADs. Here we go. This is the damage. This is the Eno experience. That baits the DP as well. Okay. Okay. Into the swag combos. Combos. Oh, the fire storms. May maybe so first sad. hit? Oh no. <laughs> Oof. Backdashes into the Fafnir. Yeah, this loop. time this time decides to not bait it. Ah. Uh, this time JD. That's sad. Pico sitting on, on uh, 100 tension, we know what this means. Let's see it's, how... It's looking slightly crunchy. Oh, there we oh. go! There it is! And his spot even... was on the table. Can't even burst out of that after that throw. Nope. All that, right. That's one. <laughs> Stay up. Pay up! Oh, that's my favorite. Free money. Five? Didn't you say 20? Oh, five IKs. <laughs> you agreed on five IKs. Oh, oh okay. Oh. So... <laughs> oh, no. I mean, we got five five games to go, technically. Okay. He... Leaf says five per IK. Stale says 20 for five. Okay. So much math. I'm not involved in this. Math, not even once. I don't even know frame data. I'm just here to play video games. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Trigger doesn't even have a burst here. And Bingo has so much meter as well. A little too early on that command crab. Oh no. <laughs> Wait, get, it, get it, get it, get it. That's number two. Did she actually try to purposely drop the combos and fish for the Kondra <laughs> hits? Yo, that's 200 IQ. No. <laughs> Next, kill. An actual businesswoman. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> Here comes the money. This is the money for KY15. Here comes the money. This is... <laughs> Oh no. Uh oh. Oh, trigger. Does have a burst here, but choosing to not use it, that's. That was funky. Dangerous. Like that. Okay, blitzes. Oh no. Oh, burst bait attempt. Dick throwing. Burst bait yes. attempt again. She wants it's... it out of his fucking barn. Yeah, it's, it's definitely okay. in, in Soul's best interest to try to go for the burst safe route after, after that wild throw, but it it is a link, so there's a small chance you might drop it. Oh. Nice. Okay, I like that. Straight note. Ooh, ooh. Is that it? Oh, I guess. That's it. That's number three. This. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> yeah, at this point, just save time. Just save time. That's number three. <laughs> what the hell is this? That's no. something I would have never <laughs> expected in my life. That's two games with three IKs. <laughs> I I hope you're enjoying the meal. I've never seen anything like it <laughs> in a in a tournament setting. None, 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 nonetheless. <laughs> I hope Trigger is fine. I hope Trigger is fine. <laughs> we'll never recover from this public humiliation. We're not even halfway through the same. I mean, it's it's. I, I look at it more like a, it's it's an honor to die by the IK. Oh, nice IB there and punish on landing. I think it's it's more like a ritual suicide. Right, right, right. Exactly. Right. right. <laughs> oh, it's it's looking crunchy again. Okay, burst out. Don't want to. Don't want anything to do with this riot stamp nonsense. Okay, get that, get that. Very clean snipe, overhead Ooh. starter. Okay, okay, oh, no. <laughs> no. 
Oh, good use oh, of the SD there. What is any of this? And this is kind of what Soul wants to go for the brawl situations. Oh, no. If you brawl with Soul, this is usually what ends up happening. Oh, hello. Oh, oh here we go. No, she gave up on the, on the IK in this one. Oh, that's. Yeah. Just get it oh, over that's with. so smart! That was actually a, a guaranteed setup. If if Trigger blocks that there, they're gonna die because they don't, didn't have any meter to FD. Yo, and they're gonna end up taking the set that, or that run. No. no! Not quite. You were talking so much. That was <laughs> that was the smartest thing I've ever seen. Using <laughs> using this movement, using the dive to stay airborne and avoid the yeah, complete yeah. active frames of that super. Stalling in the air for a bit. Oh, that was a heartbreak. <laughs> How did he get to be? Finding the low. Yeah, choosing to milk it out here. We go into the corner. Trigger still Ooh. doesn't have a burst. Trigger not taking out. Oh, okay. Oh, no. Uh oh. Oh, Piku. <laughs> not the wake up PP again. Good blocks. Ooh. Should be hit. able to. Oh, Ooh, YRCs. Yeah. yeah, good decision. Good decision. Ooh, I like the confirm. Okay, that okay. was interesting momentum. Like a PP again. Pink is really trigger heavy on these. Oh, oh the back! <laughs> like, fuck your IKs! <laughs> oh, oh no. Oh, that's so brilliant! Good IB. Oh, no. No RC combo. Go <laughs> for it. <laughs> oh no. no. <laughs> what is any of this? What is this? Like, hmm, there is no eye case to be had here. I guess I just oh. gotta finish the round. Oh no. Oh. <laughs> Stale's still waiting though. <laughs> Mess with the clown, you get this. <laughs> oh, beautiful. Beautiful. We are breathing exit right now. This is, this is so nice. <laughs> Yo. All right, there's the burst that Pink was hunting for, and now the corner pressure without the opponent having burst. Yeah, this is so. I don't know about the the Kudakura now. Oh, okay. Potentially tension. Very close to finishing, not quite. Or, or <laughs> Fuck me a YRC 2 free take throw. Disgusting. That's the classic, when you have any any sort of forward advancing special move. No, no. You have the time for the T back there! What? The mental warfare, it's on. Good 6P. Oh my god. I would I would like to note here that these two matched uh, pre-made without, without my intervention. They signed up as a match. So... They wanted this. Ooh, the burst bait. Again, Pingu has been burst baiting quite a bit. Now, how to get the gold bur or the gold IK here? Command grab, I always mean, an option. Command but grab I is a super solid option. She but just guess... needs that one opening. But Come that's... on, don't, don't throw away the 100 tension. Oh! That's a lot of value for Trigger. It's kind of working against her though, because at this point Trigger has to know that she's hunting for it. So you yeah, can kind of yeah. narrow down what kind of starters uh, she goes for, right? Right, ooh, drops the conversion. obviously also limiting herself a lot by, you know, not using tension basically in rounds where she wants to get the AK. Right, right, right. Oh, well, that's gonna be good. Yep. That's gonna hit. Oh, oh what the? <laughs> the low, but no conversion. Nice escape. Oof. The upward far slash. Oh, and there it is. Diving under, get the low. Trigger on the board. 
Wait, closest, Gatling's into 2k. That's interesting. Your trigger was so ready for that. Oh, big dunk! Bandit oh. Bringer, one of those special moves out. that actually get you big combos even without counter hit or meter. Ooh, deep 6p. Mm -hmm. ID, yeah, got them on point. Oh. Oh, unfortunate RC timing. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was that. terrible. That was so bad. <laughs> sort of karmic justice when you drop a combo like that, but I still like it. I like how she could have gone into a dust loop or anything. She just did close STP. It doesn't even knock down. <laughs> Gotta take that mental damage instead. Oh. Okay. Combos. Will this scale? Oh, it's this... too scaled. It's way too scaled. Oh, and he drops as well. There you go. Stroke. Seals the deal. Oh, now we got the real taunts. Now this will give oh. Binku 50 meter round start. Straight into the place. Oh, no. <laughs> Gets interrupted by the you note know, barely. Oh, it's nice. Stroke wire C. I like that. The Eno micro dash. Oh. Yo, the I beam to throw. The professional <laughs> plays. Holy shit. The legend air throw IB is real. Okay. We're doing actual combos. We're spending Mina. No IK this round. Unless she wants to go for a cheeky go burst setup. Yeah, I guess. Right here. It's the best. Oh. Your, your best bet is to just use your meter here and get a round first so you get an opportunity for a gold IK next round, what? I think. You're right, she, she does have three on the table already, so if she, if she uses the, the, the game winning IKs, that'll get her to five. Oh! Oh! oh. Good, good adjustment like there from for Trigger. Guided the note just low enough so that Grand Viper won't go under. Yeah. Heaven or hell. Duel. Duel. One. One. Let's rock. Rock. Oh no. Ooh, barely avoiding oh, the BB. Moving around so much now. Oh, that's usually uh -oh. usually used as a burst bait. But the timing of the burst was, I guess, late enough so that Stroke the Big Tree didn't manage to avoid it. Oh, what is this? Looks like Ooh. a good idea there, but. Oh my god. Lots of spaghetti on the floor. Who's gonna pick it up first? Oh, oh it's, it's Trigger who ends up getting thrown here. Okay, get your knockdown. <laughs> Could I get Uh, Okay, go into the corner. Oh, Oof. yeah, that's a big hit. And she has the meter as well. Oh, uh. Good attempt, try to grab Trigger out of the sky. Ooh, that's it. Nice. Nice, clean micro dash. Gone yeah, flame the, as well. the run flame went so far. Well. <laughs> what the hell? Ooh. <laughs> run flame, I love that name. <laughs> I haven't heard that before. Really? Yeah. Alright. Ooh, into the wrong direction. And now Pinku, building that Oof. meter. Just have some options here. Oh, okay. She's on. She's on a full 100. Triggers are flashing. She she needs this command grab. No. Okay. Oh, <laughs> what was that? What was that? Still trying to build more. I mean, she has some life to spend here. Could also at this point you have access to the Blitz IK as well. Oh, that's it. Yeah. A little too much damage. Okay. Now she has to somehow get at least one red IK. Yep. This is gonna be a little a little more difficult. Die slow. <laughs> Confirm better. Or hell. Duel. Duel. One. One. 
use less Mina. Disgusting. Oof. Pretty even trade with the projectiles. That's not an even trade though. Gunflame, one of the best starters for Soul. Oh. Reset. That's another another thing that you see you know players getting a lot of value with not getting not, not being able to mash or opponent not being able to mash out of that stagger and you know yeah. able to race at their combo with the black beats nice saves themselves okay. oh interesting yeah throw I, I feel like pinker's trying to build stone Oh, that's... Okay. I don't think that's, that's it. Oh, she's she's going for a stray. No, Trigger trigger wouldn't, wouldn't run into that, I think. I, I doubt it. Oh, no! Oh, no! <laughs> <laughs> IK as an anti-air! But that kind of works! Because the IK activation does have some invo frames. As it long has as a lot of invo. Yeah, as long as you've declared. That trigger was... did... <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, on the retrospect, that was kind of a risk for a trigger yeah, to approach I, like I that. I don't know. That seemed pretty committed. Oh no, he's <laughs> my man's dying. <laughs> Damn trigger, the footsies. Okay, never mind. Never mind. That's number four though. One more. Yeah, and if she misses oh. this one. Yeah. No, no monies. Yeah, Ooh, big you can't afford to uh, to use meter in this round. She needs to build that up for the gold IK, and then all Trigger needs to do is jump around and try not to get grabbed. They're playing so slowly. Oh, that's it. oh no, that's, that's it. it. That's it. Yes. It's GG's. Give it to me. Here comes the money. <laughs> That is 45 euros on the table for Pinku. Here comes the money. Money, money, <laughs> money, money. Dollar, dollar, dollar. Uh, okay. Pay out bitches. <laughs> beautiful, beautiful. I respect the dedication so much. <laughs> I want to thank my mom and my girlfriend. Uh. Well, that was definitely lucrative. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, who needs to even take this series of events when you can make this good money? Honest, for just... Honestly, if, if Pinker does this for all the first to fives, I'm... <laughs> Might as well just cancel the match, you know? <laughs> yep. <laughs> anyway. All right, next on the menu, if we next have... Week. Sierra Vice versus Frank Bottle, if they are ready to go. I went ahead and pinged them on Discord. Uh, Sierra is offline. That's slightly concerning. Oh no, there he is. Nice. Okay. All right, Sierra Vice is actually one of the players I've um, I had pleasure watching. I think when they sort of entered the scene, I think Sierra Vice is originally a, a Dragon Ball player, if I'm not mistaken. But I uh, don't even know. But made a made a pretty fast progress on not just Exert, but also on the Strive front. And yeah, now has a has a very 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 strong RAM. Yeah, it's been like... around a lot. And Frank Bottle, um, a name I've read uh, quite a while ago, not so much lately. It's interesting to see they're back. I haven't seen them around at all these past couple of months, but uh, Spanish Alpha player. It's also been around for a while. I think I think Stale told me last time he, he fought them was back in Sign. <laughs> so. That's a long time yeah. ago. 
Talking about OGs. Yeah. All right. Let's see how this works. As far as the matchup goes, I think the uh, Elfo sister should go fairly even against each other. Ooh, nice. Oh. Doesn't quite pick up off that. Now, of course, the name of the game for Ram is gonna Oof. try to somehow get that set play rolling, whereas Elfo is much more footsie based. That said, Ram is probably gonna be on the run trying to set oh. up swords every Here we possible go. scenario. This is gonna take a, gun uh, a good minute. And there's the knockdown. Ooh, Reverse the throw. The how? I like that's, it. Yeah, that's. I, I'm not sure how, but that's that's yeah. so that's so <laughs> valuable. <laughs> that is worth so much. Who's gonna eat the the six k and whatnot? Yeah, when you get oh, that Elfeld corner pressure. Basically, when you get in into the put into the corner by either one of these characters, yeah. it's it is it feels so bad. Your 6 p hitting from behind, of course. Overhead. <laughs> Out of the corner. Oh, that reads it. Oof. Like an open book. It's my turn now. It's been my turn this whole round. Overhead gets blocked. Nice. Oh, that's big. Counter hits that's 6 a well. Into the corner. Overhead again. <sighs> that's it. When it comes to Ram... Ram's like probably overall the most dangerous character to be put in the corner against. But then again, Elfold and her unblockable setups. Just to name yeah. like one option. If, if, even like the shotgun pressure, it's all so so overbearing. Elfold's extremely scary. Ooh, I think tried to go for an empty low there, but missed the meaty timing. Yeah, Frank has the XP advantage. I, I, I can definitely see that. We, we saw a single overhead from from Sierra and that got blocked immediately. Uh, Frank seems to have some some matchup experience against them. Uh, I don't know about Sierra. Uh, we used to have a couple of active Elfelds in Germany, but they're more or less retired now. So I don't know how much experience he has fighting Elfeld. Ouch. Ouch! Ouch! Well, That's a little bit of risk on the bottom as uh, well. Alright, we have a chance. Frank Bottle might be forced to burst here depending on how this goes. Oh! Nice! Oh, it gets caught! Okay, no knockdown though. No! Uh, Not the bridle! Not the bridle! Yeah, the jump PP conversion wasn't quite potent enough to finish it. I think air throw would have not been enough either. Yeah. Luckily, Frank Bottle gets to keep their burst. And now, oh. like this. Okay, defense. Gets opened up by the law. Ooh, nice. Good challenge there, 6P. Oh Ooh. my goodness. How did he move over the projectile? Ooh, nice. nice. There's a throw. That struggles into the corner. Yep. Okay. Set it up. It's once again a beat. Lockdown. Dead angle out. Yeah, overhead. First bait. That's it. No, not quite. Never mind. I lied. Sierra's alive. Okay, okay. This is so into good the for corner. Sierra. I mean, Frank Bottle is going to build the burst back, but this is a very good position to be in. Okay, okay. Nice. I really like that. I think Sierra Vice was sort of conscious of the fact that Frank Bottle was sitting on a round lead and didn't even attempt to bait it. Yeah, I mean, Ram's also really good at baiting bursts, so it's really risky to pick a point where to burst. Like, Sierra could have just done a couple of 4Ps, as we all know and experience. I, I feel like may maybe there was, there was also some fear there. And the... <laughs> Perfect, doesn't even need to burst, okay. Funny that, I think that 6 heavy was supposed to be a throw for a Frank Bottle, but oh. it ended up working out. Heaven or hell. Duel. 
Ooh, big one. Yeah, I immediately burst out of that. Uh, far slash hitting really far away. <laughs> They're moving around. Okay, get your knockdown. And this is, yeah, this is one of the... Shotgun. If you don't know how shotgun works, it's one of the most ridiculous things to defend against in the game. Waiting for the plus frames out of the bomb. Yeah, Ooh. simple conversion. But the con consistency here, after Frank Bottle manages to land a hit, he just has been able to run the set play pretty much from start to finish flawlessly so far. All right, very good position for Sierra. Frank Battle still doesn't have a burst yet. Ooh, right. overhead. Back into the corner. Oh, what a reason! Oh, that's it. Yep. Nice. And, and then the other side of the coin, you get put back in, or you get put back in the corner. Ram runs, a couple of mix-ups on you. It can be over really fast. Ooh, Pridal Express, nice whiff punish there on the Rekka. Oh no, that's a big one! Sierra Vice doesn't even have a burst here! Oh, the unblockable. Okay, Next hit. Loop. And... Mm, oh, waits the out the trap. reversal blitz there. Yeah. With Another the perfect, oof. It's a very, very momentum-based matchup. Remember yes. the basics of CQC. Yeah, yeah. Heaven or hell. Duel. Duel. One. One. Let's rock. Oh. What? Ooh. Oh, okay. Get a little command grab. Into the corner. No overhead. Who still manages to keep Frank Bottle in the corner, prompting a burst from from Frank Bottle. Ah, missing the setup. Now this is bad. Yeah, I don't blame him. Spending the burst here. Oh, a little early on the overhead. The overhead. The second one hits. There it is. That kill. Yep, that's it. Yeah, the latest, like, three, four rounds have been pretty much a testament to how this matchup goes. You get one hit yeah. and just snowball with that momentum. Yeah, you get put in the corner. You're again, stuck there for a good half minute at least. Oh, it doesn't block the overhead. Now it's Frank who's calling the shots. Sierra does have 50 meter here. Let's see what we can do with it. The Blitz has been... Ooh, Ooh. nice check! Okay. Somehow gets out of the corner with that. Frank puts himself in. Oh, yeah, reversal it's... throw. Back in the corner for Sierra. Very conscious of Frank's And he has a shotgun, that's death. Ah. <clears throat> I feel like I feel like there was a like like a burst bait somewhere in there. If Sierra Wise just runs <laughs> that offense and forces Frank to use burst, that might have been better. Not sure. It's a it is a mystery. But we have one more round. All right, nice jump in. Overhead. They're there just kind of standing at this distance, okay. Oh, nice, manages to get there in time before the sword activates and face the burst! Oh. Another burst bait. Into the other corner with you. Oh no. Okay, grenade Loki. Now what? CQC! Yeah. Using That's it horrible. using it very sparingly, sparingly in the... Uh, in during moments that I, I really do count. Alright, four to zero. 
Again, one of those games where the score doesn't necessarily reflect the whole story of the match. Terravice has come really, really close to finishing some of these rounds. Yeah, the, the, the general game flow seems pretty polarizing. Yeah, and close slash anti-air. Here we go, into the corner. Are you gonna burst? Ooh, roll into shotgun. Okay. What? Whoa, interesting. What? <laughs> okay. All right. Air thrown to the corner. I like it. No. <laughs> Back dash reversal throw. Overhead. Okay, this time the burst works. Six heavy out of the sky and you're... All right, okay. Nice to 2k. It's covered by the sword. Very important one for Sierra. Oh, I wonder I wonder if that's what that was a uh, air throw in but Okay now what? <laughs> if J60 Oh it doesn't get a comment No! Will this be it? No, not quite! That was the so spaghetti. smart! The spaghetti! Oh there were so many smart plays for Sierra in that round. The Chumpy oh. intercepting the bridal, the sword set to stop your momentum to avoid the grenade, but mm. didn't quite get there. And now Frank Bottle is on set point. <laughs> Let's take throws. That looks pretty funny. Sierra struggling to get out oh, of this corner. Oh. All right, we're out. So okay. Positions. Okay. Now what? Oh, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Frank really likes that backdash. It seems really good. It's so fast. Oh, it gets caught though. Doesn't get punished for it too bad. Nice escape. All right, Frank can probably sit pretty comfortably here for a while. Frank's sitting on 100, I wonder. Yeah, and a burst. Oh, okay. So it's super. We do a little Guts Crush. Overhead. Yeah, overhead. Okay. Nice. That Still was alive. covered. That was covered by all the Coletta there. I didn't see that. We breathe. Ooh, okay. Nice. Okay. Oh. And now in the corner, Pineberry. Oh no! The whip punishes the relentless oh pressure! God. Okay, burst down. Just somehow get out of this corner. No! 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 And back into it, the overhead hits! Uh, the overhead! As the other vice, no burst! CQC! Oh, uh, this may be it. Oh, oh that, no! That's so optimal! Oh! oh. <laughs> Too high! Sierra with one more chance! Ah, no. oh, but misses the overhead. Oh. <laughs> with the use of that okay. five heavy, that's that's gonna be a comfortable whiff punish even from half screen. Alright. I okay. do like I do like that combo route. I think so. Frank Bottle had 100 meter there, but the combo was super pro rated. I think even with a burst super, that might not finish. So deciding to go for that IK was probably the the most optimal decision there. Too bad it dropped though. Yeah. All right. Next up, we have Leapfrog versus Deva. Um, Tamkin Leo. Interesting. Speaking of leapfrog, I saw him ask in chat how uh, the skull worked for these. Um, if the win loss counts, or also the the games. Um, it's different between a first encounter and a and a rematch for this. So these are obviously all first encounters. Uh, how these work is um, the loser gains one point, the winner gains the amount of the amount of uh, games won plus one. So uh, for this, uh, for example, Pinku uh, gains six points, Trigger gains one because Pinku won the set. If they match again, if they play again in a tournament or in um, a next first to five, um, Pinku will, the, um, how would I put it? The points Pinku would gain for another win is reduced by the difference in points of the previous match. Uh, the points Trigger would gain is increased by the uh, by the difference in points from the previous match. Looking at the the five ball right here, if, if Sierra were to win a rematch against Frank Bottle, uh, he would gain an additional five points. 
So that that would mean uh, Sierra would would gain 11 points for winning a rematch against uh, Frank, for example. That is roughly how it works. Okay, into the actual video game. Now this this matchup is quite of a dogfight. Both characters yeah. do enjoy being close and personal. The thing is, mm. the Potemkin factor, no character in this game really does enjoy being close and personal with Potemkin. But Leo, yeah. Leo does have some um, options for playing like mid-range. Oh! Yeah, I haven't seen this this character matchup a lot. Uh, I think I've seen it once or twice in Challenger League with Akarol versus Pet, but that's already been a while ago. I don't think these two have played before. This is going to be interesting to watch. Oh, Ooh, not quite went for the double heat. Oh no! <laughs> but the reset! Bam! Yeah, RPS is definitely the name of the game here. <laughs> Potemkin being the crappler, you know, you're always in a tick mix-up and then Leo. Sort of like the embodiment of RPS. Here we go. Get your knockdown. ID cross-up. I wonder if they tried the, the, the Tomo cross-up there, but just didn't get the jump slash out. <laughs> Oh, low blitz. Good call out. The Leo, the Leo uh, back turn K. Such a dangerous button. There it is. Ooh, very nice, catching the one vulnerable frame of backdash. <laughs> <laughs> it's with the full screen ICPM. Nice, gets the multi hit, breaks the armor. Here we go. Oh. Yo, the long leg of the king. That's actually such a nice button. It's active for so long, and active frames is what you're looking for when you're baiting uh, Potemkin's backdash. The uh, JK? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's it's so good. Oh no! <laughs> oh no! Dying. Extending into the buster, but not even faced about that. Okay, take the ring pot. Oh, high blitz this time. Right, full RC there. Uh -oh. Reset pressure. One more touch. Is that that's it? Oh, it? Yes. That looks so goofy, but it works. OTG ICBM leapfrog opens it up with the first point. Heaven or hell. Duel. Leapfrog is really another true Guilty Gear enthusiast, playing basically all yeah. the three Guilty Gear games at the same time currently. I think he's dropped Strive a while ago. Mm -hmm. He's currently on, on Plus Armor too. Yeah, I think, yeah, tra sort of transferred some of their interest into, into the older game. That kind of makes sense. A lot of Potemkin players have been doing that, because Potemkin in Strive is a very different beast compared to ACPR and Exert. Oh! Okay, reset. Alright, okay. drop him. But here's the RPS, what's it gonna be? The lows? Low. Lows. More lows. More <laughs> overhead. Oh, it gets me. <laughs> oh no, the delay. Oh no. Oh no. What is this? It what is this? Oh! You! <laughs> footage of the of the guard point actually doing something in Exert. Holy shit! Oh, that was impressive. It's It's been a while since I saw anything done with that guard point stance. Yeah, oh. <laughs> oh, Potemkin Buster by the level. Alright, spent a 50. Ooh, tried to reset Ooh. there, I think. Ah! There it is again. It, I think I've seen, I, I'm, I'm seeing the little step forward from from the uh, from the five heavy that Leapfrog ends mm. up throwing. Oh! Especially without back turn on, Leo's pressure has sort of, like, Leo has strong pressure, but it has a lot of gaps. And Potemkin, especially with IBs, is, yeah, is, yeah. is very interested in, the, in your gaps. If you know where to force your way through a crack, you can really go for it. Alright, okay. I want to see if that was like the first... Oh, empty! <gasps> Is that Will this kill? Almost! Not quite! Oh! Reset into the 5B. Oh. 
Yeah, so far, Daver has, has I want to say, baited perfectly uh, every single backdash from Leapfrog Pocho, but that was yeah. that was the one one time when Leapfrog actually got it off. Oof. And capitalized as well. Wake up 6p. I wonder if that was intended. Ooh. Okay, that's that's three counter hits. With Potemkin, you always gotta keep an eye out for the stun. Okay, I think they were safe again. Lots of IBs. Yeah, as it should be for Potemkin. Yeah, yeah. Oof. Oh, it tries to bait a burst. <laughs> yeah, there it is! What? Finding the gap. If it has three that was frames. So far away! If it has three frames of gap, the Tenkin <laughs> players be like, hmm. Oh no. Oh shit. Here we go. No, don't do that! But the burst bait! Okay. Does it burst? Gets grabbed. That's so much damage. Still no burst. They was holding on to it. There we go. Oh, oh but the backdash once again. Backdash PB. No burst. So many burst baits, but at this point, I think Daver's just. Windmill, yeah, windmill PRC, YRC, anything. No, that's it. Okay, doesn't burst there. Oh, you, how did that air throw whip? No. <laughs> that was such a perfect position. Might have been just a couple of frames too late there. Oh, that was so sad. Yeah, sometimes inputting that perfect low altitude air throw can be difficult, especially when you throw up yeah. your own timing with the YRC. Okay, take throw. Oh! The backdash. Leapfrog is getting so much value out of that backdash. Okay, okay. Oh, it gets flicked! Oh. Doesn't block the overhead, actually presses into it. Now this this burst would be super hard to justify for Daver, yeah. They're just uh, content holding it yeah, for yeah. the next round. Oh, <laughs> oh the crack, hello! God, armor and guilty gear. You can hit from behind in armor. You always turn around. It looks so wag. Oh, and the first <laughs> PRC there. Uh, seems to have messed up the flick timing. Ah! Leapfrog really wants that big mash on the wake up. I think with yeah, that backdash looking for yeah. either throw mashes or like some bigger buttons or even the DP. And Davis trying to go around the, the backdash with 5p as well, but it's not quite working out. Yeah, it's like even if you have a setup in okay, mind, Tito? it's. Now what? Low blitz? Yeah, you have to burst that. That was death. No! Oh, so, so, close. so, so close. Oh. Leapfrog confidently running away with the lead. Yeah. As you would expect. The, the score could be looking so differently. Oof. That's a lot of stun. <laughs> the good old full screen with punish. Ooh, interesting, oh, interesting. Wow, okay. Oh, not again. Alright, this time checks it. Fight BPP, but. Now, the name of the game. What are we gonna do here? There's a lot of life to still chew through. And one read okay. from Lead for Pocho. Oh, there yeah, he is. Yeah, look at that. Ah, Daver started out so strong being able to catch those timings, but. Yeah. It is only one one single frame that you have to aim for. It's not the easiest thing. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Flash kick. Okay. Catches the back dash. Nice. All right. Catches it this time. Oh. Oh, the second hit didn't activate yep. fast enough. Tries to beat the burst again. They were so patient with that. Oh no! Runs into the flick projectile. Okay. Okay, that's, yeah, that's plus. No presses. Yeah, I, I think Leapfrog didn't get a full charge there, so. Okay, get your knockdown. One more. One more. Jungle. Oh no! A big oh, chance for Leapfrog. This is so scary. 
to set oh. one. <laughs> okay. Just in okay. time. Yeah, that S, S Sonic Boom YRC is such a good tool for finishing yeah. rounds with. Oh no! Ah, uh, doesn't quite get the distance. Okay. All right. David doesn't want to deal with the Oki. Okay, catches back dash this time. Oh. <laughs> nice. All right, all right, here we go. And now just be careful. Nice, pressure reset with the oh, oh no. Gaps. I, I think that was meant to be a uh, heavenly. Okay, like Brock has a burst. When's it gonna come out? Holding. Opting to spend the. Ooh, ooh. Guard cancel first. Okay, okay. One more good interaction for Deva. And he's on the board. Oh! Oh, try uh -oh. to use the guard point! Oh no, that's oh, it. That's it. that's it. That's the set. Oh my god. Leapfrog with the last decisive DP read. Oh, Busters oh, Daver out of the set. Oh. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Rarely have I have I seen a 5 0 that felt this close. Ooh, oh man. Yeah, Ooh. it's it's like any one of those sort of attempts to catch Potemkin's backdashes could have been it, but so close yet so far. All right, next up, Sable. Um, Versus Pepe. Yes. So, uh, to reiterate, um, if, say, uh, Leapfrog and Dave would participate in the tournament mid-February uh, mid in, I think, two weeks? Should be two weeks from now. Um, <clears throat> and they meet, and Dave uh, ends up winning the set. Dave will gain not only the amount of points for the set, which would probably be three points for the first to two, uh, but also an additional five points, because that's the difference of the previous set. So, rematches and, and runbacks are encouraged. Okay, Pepper's here. We're ready and we're good to go. <clears throat> Elfelt Faust. I have no clue how this plays out. Uh, I think it's, like, negative for Faust. But, you know, Faust is another one of those really beastly characters in this game in terms of matchup charts. Doesn't really have a whole lot of bad matchups but mm -hmm. if he does this might be the one elfold has like like any character who has good toolkit for challenging faust's neutral game plan can be kind of mm. difficult to deal with your dream husband is waiting and he is nine foot tall there he is look at him Okay, let's see. Ooh, starting oh, medium. off with... <laughs> Item.txt right enabled. Right. Yeah. Wow, okay. Another kind of JH. Yeah, kind better of being... Throws. I want to say really conscious of how how Elfo probably wants to play this matchup. Sniping yeah. her out of the sky with that jump heavy. Yeah, he's really, really trying to... Um, Cover some some airspace. Oh, oh nice! Okay. I'd be on the way down. Oh. Extending himself into the five heavy. <laughs> oh, still drains with the hammer. We'll take it. Oh. Okay. It's really funny how Elfold's five heavy hitbox and or or rather the hurt box actually works. It's like it, it kind of extends. So you have a lot of buttons that like five, sorry, sorry, Kai two heavy, etc. That can actually like beat it clean depending on the sp space and the position. Oh, look at that! Just floating in there. Well, oh, that was really close, uh, close to a double KO. <laughs> oh, runs through the whiff fires. Interesting. Nice maneuvering. 
Okay, IVs. IVs. Right, what's up? Yeah, got that. The cheeky FTC. The stable of fast mix ups. It's the kind of oh. Ooh, nice. Okay. He's some really decent items so far. Pretty much all of them have been relevant. So many J2Ks. Look at that. Another mini Faust on the way. Not gonna do too much. The space control from Pepe is immaculate. Another <laughs> meteor. They didn't even need it. Man, this is definitely how you wanna play the matchup. Yeah. And Pepe, looking like everything that they did that match was deliberate. There's no misinputs, just perfect predictions, perfect execution. Everything was just perfect. That was a textbook round there. L6H. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Couldn't quite get most out of that Michael Bay conversion. Snipe, I think. Oh, yeah. Ooh, yep. The hammer. The hammer. Stun. Meteor's coming. There they are. Overhead. There you go. Yeah, even had like 100 meter to back that up. If Even if Sable blocks that overhead, it was a really difficult position. So one thing you definitely want to keep in mind against Faust is that you can't allow Faust to just hang back for free. That means he's mm. going to have time to throw item after item after item, and every single item is a RNG ch chance for him to just sort of win the momentum right there. Yeah. And that kind of... I guess that... Mm. Oh. Oh. Black hole moments. Very respectful of the reversals. Oh. Lots of pressure resets. Ooh, oh, is that an accidental air blitz? Yeah. Staying out Whoop. of the active reach of that. Pineberry. Ooh, I, I really like that. Pepe's movement is just so crisp. Plus frames here for the full charge blitched. Okay, jumping over the meat, uh, over the wave. Tried to be cheeky Again. with that 5D. Okay, okay, nice. Same Overhead, shotguns. Will this kill? Not quite. Oh, oh no! Oh. Okay, well we got death. Yeah, I feel like Sable was probably a little worried about the burst there and was mm. trying to keep it as safe as possible, but that, that hesitation there allowed Pepe to play one more RPS situation, chose the super and stole the round. Mm. Oh. Okay. Sable so going for a more uh, zone-ish approach. Uh oh. Ah, oh, but then poison oh. vial bailing him so out. Still have there. to be poison down. Oh, that was so smart. Pressing into the mini fast to make it disappear faster, so he didn't have to deal with it anymore. Similar to how you uh, would uh, extend a hurtbox into you don't know. Oh, it's side. Okay. Oof. Ooh, the momentum pull. <laughs> that looked a little bit. interesting. Oh, here we go. All oh, messes up the FTC. Big baby. Man, I think Pepe hasn't missed a single IB on those pine berries yet. Oh! <laughs> yeah. Uh, so it was a little, a little undecided there. Yeah, I can understand that. The right option was to press a button into that charge blitz because he was reading yeah. for the full charge, yeah. but the timing. Timing didn't quite hit. Yeah, the, the, the thought came a little too late there. 
I feel that. Ah, uh, CQC. Okay, okay. Shocker loops. With the grenade. With everything. This is looking so good all of a sudden. Super? Yep. No, I do! That was the wrong super! You should have done a super no! Well, if something positive, Sable at least has a lot of <laughs> life to play with here. Oh. You say that. You say that. But where did all that life just go? That was like <laughs> one exchange. Oh. Okay. No, but it's not enough! Really now? One there you go. Move. There we Grenade go. Grenade chips it out. Whew. I thought we were going to see like an, an OTG sniper there. Starting to sweat there for a moment. Let it work. Okay. Now. Again, using the FDC, oh. avoiding the gunshots. Ooh, good oh. check there. Doesn't let Sable oh. take that shotgun out for free. But still in the corner. This is bad. Sable has so much meter. Nice! The DP 5D. Or the quotations DP. <laughs> oh. Oh, that's good! The rare footage when the self explosion actually gives you value. It's not over yet. Bazooka, there you go. No! <laughs> the poison. <laughs> oh, it's dangerous. Oh, I swear, go. I swear, Pepe has all the best items available all the time. I didn't even notice the poison vial was there, and I think <laughs> Sable was like, all right, now is my time to go in and run straight into the poison. What a tragedy. So sad. Oh no. Ooh, nice. Again, the Pineberry self explosion sometimes what? allows you to get a better combo. I. I, I think Sable aimed the, uh, the the crosshair there a little bit further to the down uh, to the bottom right. I couldn't even see it on screen. That was a little cheeky. Oh, 5D with the invo. Very short window, but can still utilize it. Okay, corner combos. Oh, oh. Well, the bomb is there. Yes. Luckily for Sable, Pepe there wasn't able to properly convert that. That's it's kind of dangerous. The bomb from Faust items is at least one of better starters for Faust himself. Oh wow, tricky stuff. Nice check, yeah. Reach that. Eventually they need to come back in. Sable. Maintains the momentum, good block on the overhead. Oh, yeah, block that. Ah, Tracer to press, it's plus though. Ooh, cross up with the poison, that's smart! Wasn't running his full course. Oh, Tracer jump out, gets sniped. He has to Meteor's avoid on this. screen, it's gonna be a little... Oh no, it, it aims, never mind, never mind. That's a lot of risk. It's not gonna matter. Next oh. interaction, kills, there you go. <laughs> I thought Sable was gonna float over about that, but still uh. gets clipped. Yo, that was very smart. Aggressive dash under the bomb back. Didn't quite get the right button out though. Uh. Okay, okay. Overhead. Right, oh, yeah. what? How did the hurt box extend it to the poison vial now? Oh, here we go! Oh, no! The, the 2k! The 2k is multi hitting! Was it the 2k that clashed? I... Yeah, yeah, it was the, the first set of 2k clashing. Yeah, and so. The, the next two connected anyway. Yeah, that, that, that requires a little bit of presence of mind. If you clash with a multi hitting move, Unless you like straight up cancel into DP, you can't really do much because obviously yeah. your startups. It's it's way way faster than anybody's startup. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. Okay. Right. The neutral here. Sable gets there in time. Oh. That works. Cute little trick. Counter. 
Tries to get a snipe, claw slash, anti-air. Nice, manages to cross under again, keeping Pepe in the position. Yeah, oh. good work there. Okay. CQC. Pe Pepe's, Pepe's blitz response, he hasn't been using the tap glitches, he's been holding on to it and Sable yeah. finally starting to catch on to that. Okay, that works. <laughs> I like the rose. Yo helium, yeah. Keep that. Keep that on screen. Make it last for as long as possible. I know he can throw another item. What? Yeah. In this game, a lot of the quotations useless items are sort of like a down, just just a downside for Faust because they can't be overwritten while they exist in the or new items can't be thrown. Finds another good two P once again. Really good on Pepe getting out of that shotgun pressure so consistently. Nice run under. Close S. Get that. Alright. Oh, I think there was maybe meant to be some sort of a... Oh no! <laughs> what is this? Sable just wants to land. Oh no. Overhead again. First good timing. First him into the corner. Out of it again. Oh! No, nope, oh, we can't punish that. That's a gold burst. No punishing that. Unless you're in range. There to you throw. go. That's the game. Snipe. Ah yes, like Elfo, like the that. precursor to Happy Chaos. <laughs> Almost. Not quite. <laughs> When's the the Strive mod coming out with the uh, Alpha voice lines for Happy Chaos? I bet someone's <laughs> already done that. <laughs> I bet someone just flat out has already made a mod that replaces Happy Chaos with everything Elfeld. Oh no, not everything. <laughs> oh no. Happy Chaos with a shotgun stance. Okay, going my way to land. You the IB! Oof. Really clean instant overhead. The okay. trap ends up trading. Oh, that's a big one, though. Nice, nice confirm. Get the grenade. Again, the Oof. meteor is coming. The... Yep, there oh! it is, and it kills. Oh. I wonder, Sable was probably betting on the meteors not homing that much, but they came mm. through all the way. Yeah. Oh, the spring doing its thing. Oh, okay. Right, the self explosion from the Bindberry kind of screws up the anti air combo. Nice throw. Good, good. Good response. Oh, Alpha with with helium. That's torture. I'm so sorry. This uh oh. Is this is dangerous. Pepe is on a set point. And Sabel, dangerously low on life here. Finds a way out. Now, Pepe, are we spending the burst? Or are we waiting for the next round? Not quite. Dead angle. Sable wants this. Oh. Nowhere to back down to. What? <laughs> no, not the spring. Sable just go with the sniper stance, maybe? I don't know. Last hit point. No, no, no. no. Oh. It's do or oh. die. The momentum delay. Oh, is that it? Mm. Yes. Sniper. Oh. Sniper again? Maybe? Yo, Pepe! There it is, unblockable. Pepe at his own donut! There you go. Still alive. Clinging on. That was. I saw that. Pepe, the only reason he survived that hit was because he ate his own donut just before the, just before oh the my shot. God. <laughs> okay, get your knockdown. Grenade. It's not gonna hit. Oh, blue burst. Oh, tried to get out! Okay, okay. I like it, I like it. Overhead. Now this Shotgun is combos. Good. Yeah. No burst. It's it's your time now, Sable. They don't have a burst. Mm. And oh. finds the hit. Yes. Second game. Indeed. Sable breathes. Whew. 
<laughs> Still doable. Ooh. We're not done. We're not done. No, no, no. Heaven or hell, We're living and breathing. And honestly, it's it's slowly been swinging towards Sable's favor. Yeah. There, they've. Ooh, it feels I like, like that. I like that so much. Yeah, it's like they've they've started to see Pepe's oh. trajectories. Box, Has to respect this though. Yeah. Oh, just clipped by the bomb explosion. Oh, that's okay. still traded. <laughs> it worked out pretty well. We got him out of the corner. Oh no! And the hammer. Gold was it a counter hit at least? Yeah, I think OTG hits oh, can't no. <laughs> build much stun anyway. Yeah. Okay, okay. Okay. Ooh, drops the confirm. Sable with one more chance. Oh, uh, but they didn't cancel their dash. Ah. Uh, and that's okay. gonna give Pepe once again the set point. 70% stun reduction, okay. Then it doesn't really matter. Oh. Almost into the grenade as well. Okay, okay. Oh, that's a good hit. Oh. JDYRC, it lives. Oh, secrecy but, attempt gets interrupted. That's nice. What a good read from Pepe, but doesn't get out of the box yet. A fireworks? Don't! No! Oh, no! Okay. Ooh, Ooh back barely. Down. Recovers in time. That was, that was very risky. Nice! Okay, that's another round. That 5 is actually a pretty decent tool for for punishing those item throws at, mi uh, throws at mid range. Fucking up for back touch. Ziz on the PTSD. <laughs> I, I the understand. Sleepy, the I LFL understand. gang supports. Looking good. Pepe, building there. Head gets blocked this time. Burst is available, but. Oh! Oh my god! Air throw attempts. So many of them. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, Best but death. there it is. The, the one moment when Elfo was already going down. Oh. Yeah, I, I get that. You want to you wanna take it easy and carefully choose your spot. But there was that one time when it didn't work out. Yeah. Sable's climbing back up to the stage. Damn. Momentum has completely shifted, and yeah, if if Pepe ha doesn't manage to oh. sort of, oh. oh no, we may be speaking too soon. Oh lord, oh, Pepe wants to show us he's oh. not washed up. Yeah. That's a stun, six H. Okay, I a was hammer followed up by a bomb explosion. A bomb. Yeah. Oh, 2D under the 5H. Honestly, that's been one of Sable's banes this match. Has been getting clipped by a lot of those bombs. Playing mm. really dangerously. Oh, pfft. good timing. <laughs> I think they tried to throw, but that's even better. We'll take it, we'll take it. Sable can't afford to lose this or they're gonna go home for today. Even though they are probably already at home, they will still go home. <laughs> they will go even homer. Yes. Oh, no. Okay. One more. There you go. <clears throat> the boss baby. Back on deck. Oh no! Oh, the combo breaker. No! It actually saves Pepe. No. Okay, jump over the baby. There you go. Bomb, okay, awareness. Not the poison. Ooh, nice! Managing to maneuver into the perfect position. And now, Pepe. 
With a burst soon, but again this situation. In the corner. Reversal. Seiko also with a burst. Oh, they're fishing. They're fishing six heavy! <sighs> oh my god, what's it gonna be? Overhead. Overhead. Burst immediately. Oh, bad jumping, gets thrown for it. Oh no, it catch us! And dies! Catch us to back dash out of all things! Oh. Stale, you cursed it. Oh my god. That was a good asset. That yeah. was sick as fuck. Very nice momentum swing in the middle, allowing Sable to go for that counter chase. Almost does it as well. Whew. Okay, that was pretty good. I think that was pretty good. It's getting hotter and hotter in here. Huh. Speaking of hot, depending on your tastes. Wait a uh, Pet asks if he can go sooner. Uh, that works out. Um, yeah, sure. We could, for example, do it next. If everybody's fine with that. <clears throat> Dale's fine, that's cool. Centrion's fine as well. Alright, in that case, I guess we're gonna do the Big Bang first. Oh, I, I I think we're gonna have some some bangs afterwards as well. Oh yeah, for well, sure. The the funny matchup. Big damage man versus uh. <laughs> really, yeah. But yeah, psychedelic pet. So throughout the competitive history of Rev Two in Europe, it. It made absolutely no sense if you left out this man's name. Yeah, uh, yeah, no. On his main Potemkin, he probably was easily one of the most feared adversaries. Very decent tournament track record, both online mm. and offline, uh, pre-pandemic. Yeah. Especially the, uh, during the pandemic, online, uh, Pet was one of the one of the most dominant players. Yeah, and that's that's sort of the scary thing. He's one of the absolute premium contenders who actually still actively plays this game. Yeah, I think we, we've had, we've had Niffy around a couple times here and there. Uh, not not as active as Pet by a long shot. Yeah, I know Pet um, dabbled with Strive a little, but mm, what I've mostly yeah. seen him playing is 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 Exert. Yeah. Where are the sponsors, Pet? Can we get a sponsored exclusive Exode player? That'd be so funky. So, it's like, if, even if it's an old game, Pet is probably at the moment in the prime condition of their life. And <laughs> now, now, don't get me wrong, this is also a phenomenal, f f f f phenomenal, phenomenal <laughs> Milia player, but, uh, I mean, sometimes you need to send that one brave warrior who ventures out to slay the ultimate behemoth. This has been around and, and active in, in X-Men for as long as I can remember. Which isn't too long because I didn't get in until Rev 2. However, uh, never seen this man not around. And like we like we said earlier, it's it's not set in stone their character that is. It's gonna be yeah. sort of a surprise whether Pet decides to pull out the sub character, which is Sol, or whether they're gonna go with their main, the big old right Potemkin. Now, he's sitting on the cab with Potemkin selected. Okay, they're both in the room. Have fun from Pet. This is already ready out. All right. Here we go. <clears throat> when it comes to the matchups, I suppose, like, there's a clear disadvantage playing Potemkin here compared to Sol, of course, but 
like we talked about earlier. Even if your main character has, on paper, worse matchup against the character... Yo, that Rito! Straight in with the RPS! Psychedelic pet! Yeah, this is, w <laughs> without a doubt, uh, who he's most comfortable playing. That was a fast round, holy shit. Okay, pins out. Grabs it again. Yeah, there you go. Yo, oh, catches the jump again. Two out of two, reading the jumps. Already on the layer two. A little scared of these pop busters, which I can very much understand. It's so dangerous. Milia is such a pixie. That's also. So he cannot take a hit. Holy shit! Yeah, it's Milia. Just one oh, of those. Boy. I've got to play really perfectly here because, yeah, one touch yeah. is a kill. Consistency is key for Zizia. All right. Pet going for the big jump out read with two heavy. That's it. Ow. Another interesting point. So how Pet played the RPS there, opting to straight away go into the hard read up crab catching them out of the sky. That's kind of like a respect thing. Basically saying, I think you know the matchup and I think you're on the layer two already. Also maybe a little bit of player familiarity, sort of saying that I know you're capable of defending yourself in the most smart possible way, which is fuzzy jumping. Hmm. Oh, the 6p. <laughs> that was a little unfortunate. Uh -oh. And he's in the corner you right now. Oof. That was risky. That was so risky. Nice, okay. We'll take throwing. Overhead. Oh, ouch, yeah. Oh, wow, okay. That, that was a super dangerous burst, but... Lucky that yeah. we got it out! Which one's gonna hit first? Oh, this is so close to a stun here. Oh, no. The OTG 2D. There you go. First to five, any percent, yeah. <laughs> oh my god. I mean, even if this ends up being super tight, it could still be a speed run, considering yeah. like, how fast when Potemkin gets the right reads, the runs end. Okay, okay. Yo, conversions? Nice. I love this. I just... A simple check. Okay, Chroming Rose. Yo, it's been such a long time since I've seen this super. Come here! Nobody ever uses this. And there it goes. Yo, the active frames of 5k still catching the backdash, that's insane! Yeah, such a fast backdash. Also comes with it not having a lot of invul. Also 5k, like Fisher Price, my first meet, it has so many active frames. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that is such a good name. Oh my god. Ooh, nice. Ooh. Color of meaty button. Okay. Ooh. 6p low profiling through the knife. That's amazing. Oh. What's it gonna be? Low. Into. Simple conversion. Okay. Ooh! Ooh. Ducks Reading under it. the blue burst. That's so good. No, oh, I think. Oh, I like the rising JK for the instant overhead. That's so good. Ten billion voice lines. Yo, that was so precise. <laughs> Bet. Oh my God. This is dead. I think. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, burst safe. Low profile under with the Trishula. Oh. <laughs> that that Trishula is. For, for all intents and purposes, basically Soul 2D. Yeah, if, if Soul 2D hit like the ceiling. Yeah. Like, uh... <laughs> if it was like a <laughs> massive pillar of flames as well. <laughs> oh my god. Ouch. Oh no. Oh no. God, that's so much damage. Ah, yes, the classic. 
hiding the mix up behind the fire pillar. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so he's tried to go for another roll there to get a little bit of extra distance, but the startup of the second one allowed Pet to get that throw in. Ooh, so many right. IVs on, on Pet's side. Yeah, really happy how oh. both Potemkin players tonight have been playing Potemkin. And what <laughs> you do as Potemkin? Just flash white. You flash white, you go up. Oh, nice typing on the jump heavy. This time, the 6P not able to low profile under the pin. Yo, that oh, was so nice. Many, so many nice. Others. Right, you're gonna get hit here. Oh no! <laughs> I was like, I was about to say, don't run into it. No. Your forehead, bro. No. Really, oh no! Really, really. No, no, no! Psychedelic oh. pen. <laughs> that was. What the hell was that? That was scary. Don't do that. Oh my god! I, I thought he got the grab there. <laughs> I thought six K was throwing, bro. What? Yeah. Wait, can you even do that IK confirm on Potemkin? Isn't isn't Pot's IB like or sorry IK strictly a throw? Uh, it, it hits airborne opponents. The mo most popular uh, IK confirm I've seen is like uh, hit knuckle RC, and then you you hit them as they fall down very slowly. So it's it's one of those things that is both a throw and sort of like a strike at the same time? I, I guess so. I guess it's just an unblockable. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Who came up with that? Okay, okay. Put him in the... Oh, six... Mm. Six H come here. Right, finding the timing for the burst. Ow, 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 ow. Psychedelic like Pact really active with the massive two heavy jump out reads. Oh, that's dead. Again, so close. Or maybe not so close. Even that little amount of hit points is like two or three combos for Milia, depending on which starter you get. <laughs> oh, <And> no. Then, <laughs> there you go. If you, play, again. if you play Potemkin, you better be good at RPS. Ooh. Instant overhead. Managing to pick up the there pin on the way. Get the knockdown, get the pin back. Resets. Ooh. Ooh, oh. interesting. I'm surprised. Pa uh, Can you pull off this? Oh, it's my kill. Yes. Really okay. surprised that Pet chose to play that burst still with yeah. that life disadvantage. I guess he wanted to keep playing. Didn't work out though. This one is still active. Double heat. It's like a reverse pot matchup. Instead of getting busted all the time, they're getting the heat. Yeah. Honestly, I'll, I'll take it. It's, it's less damage. We'll yeah, take it. for sure. <laughs> Even if you get caught by that, oh, you Oh, the will... pin bounces off the wall. Trying to desperately keep Pet in the corner. All right, get there in time. Okay, get your pin back. <gasps> okay. Oh, okay, it was safe, it was safe, nice. Insta drop. Oh, yeah, nice, too many, many hits. And almost oh. gets the decisive Not conversion. Quite. Okay, no RC. Oh, this works, nice. okay. Nice, Not Not letting... three. So, so I, I was about to say, I guess it's okay for Potemkin, for Pet to go for a dangerous burst like that, because it's mm. it's a, a high chance that they're gonna build it back. But they build up it just too late there. Yeah. Ends up making a difference. Speaking of bursts, yours is baited now. Oh man. That's so much risk. That's so much risk. He's already almost dead. Important what happened? Escape. I blinked. Okay, definitely okay. love to get the pin back eventually. 
but that yeah. would mean sacrificing your position here. Okay, now we can get it back soon. We're on our way. There you go. Yeah, it rolls into it, okay. Oh, the, f Ooh. <laughs> the build got 4 H. Good response. Oh, Ooh, can I hit 2 H? No. no, it drops. Oh, that's a tragedy. That's a such a tragic oh. drop. That was Ziggs' round what to take. Was that? Raw 6H. Might have been gone. And again. Has has oh. Psychedelic Pet played a single Pick Buster yet? <laughs> um he might have. Barely missing the pin. Oh. Gold oh, he, he, okay. he waited for it, but. Now this also delayed. Good anti air. Ah, uh, once, once the relaunch doesn't quite get it. It's thrown out of 6k again. Of all the buttons that they should be throwing, well, I feel like that's that's the one, but oh well. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's like. It's kind of like checking. Uh, do, I, do I have the meter? No? Okay, yeah, I guess can not. I, can I IK? No, okay. <laughs> I guess not. We're not going to China today. My lord. I think at this point, every single RPS situation for, for the Buster, Pet is probably gonna play the... the, uh, the anti-air option, as, as long as it takes for Ziz to sort of play the respect option. Hmm. Oh, doesn't manage to tag that backdash. And now, it's been a fast one, but Psychedelic Pot, set point. Oh. Oh no. Oof. Yeah, so might want to burst that. Might want to burst that. Oh no. Wait, is, that, is that a stun? Another counter hit. This might be stunned. Really he has close. enough for the for the barrier. He doesn't even. It, it kills. Oh, it just <laughs> doesn't even have time for the stun. My oh, so, God. <laughs> so he's alter fouring. <laughs> but I mean, that's sort of oh, sort of the expected outcome here from. Yeah. Who is and, like and definitely the the favorite? Yeah. Yeah. One of the strongest players in the community currently. Optimal Alter 4. <laughs> yeah, it's to save time so you can get back to, uh, I don't know, what, what else does he do? <laughs> Play somebody else. Alright, moving back on the card yes. now. Thank, thank, thank you for the normal amounts of support, or moral support as well. I read normal support. I'm, I'm, my brain. Actually, I read thing. normal too. I am here to provide moderate support. I, I like I like moderate, decent amount of support. Don't support me too much. It's gonna feel yeah, too yeah. bad. But just like yeah. like J just su support a normal amount. Support me gently. <laughs> my my heart can't handle a massive mm. amount of support. Alright, Kiss so Kitty May okay. versus okay. Squid That's Guy Biken. Right. I, I can't believe you done, uh, done that, honey. This is this is slanderous. Anyway, Squid Guy's in. Let me let me ping Gringo. Hang on. So yeah, Keskidi, also known as. Gringo Cotton Hide, also known as Grimgar Jelly Skin. I don't know why you would do this, but <laughs> I think that's like they're they're the person who has been confusing me the most yeah. in this community. For for the longest time, I thought I thought these these names were separate people. They're not. Same. Honestly, <laughs> this is this is all just one May player, and they're here now. All right, Squid Guy, one of those players who has surprised me with their progress over the years on 
many occasions, like personally for me coming back to Exert scene, I've found that a lot of players from back in the day have got so much stronger now. I, I even ended dropping like a tournament set versus Squid Guy, even though I went into that matchup like super confident. Hmm. I, I think um, the, the very, very first on a revival that we did, uh, the grand finals were Leapfrog versus Squid. Mm -hmm. I think that's so the one. They, they, they've been, uh, they've been around and grinding for a while. So recently jumped into the Strive bike and train. Wanna mm -hmm. wanna ever uh, won their matchup on the FD7 for that mm -hmm. game, but now back to the good old. Let's see what we can do. Both on the vanilla pallets as well. Ooh, this, they, this is moving so fast, what the hell? What's going on? Yeah, after watching Potemkin stay still and just heavy button them out of the sky. There we go. Everything's moving so fast, what is this? Remember Team Axel? I, I remember Team Axel, I could never forget. Shoutouts to uh, um, Pita, Miri, and uh, uh, Carvis. Ooh, that was so sick! Tried to go for a double Azami there. Again, this time doesn't quite intercept the the ball properly with the Azami. Nice. Oh. Oh, Command, crab, Command Crab is such a useful thing against Biken. Oh, okay, burst at the last second. Didn't want to lose the round after all. Don't know about that. Okay, okay. Looking good so far. Oh, I could back dash. Yeah, May. May one of those characters who has the has the premium frames for female backdashes. The, mm. the standard premium backdash. <laughs> then there's also Milia who has like the super fast backdash that yeah. has their frames in a little different place. Alright, basic Oki. Okay. Oh, there you go. Corner throw. There you go. One of the lightweight combos. Oh, okay. Magic. Interesting. I'm, I'm not sure how you, how you get an off gun off of this. Right yeah, it's a little little more difficult, but it is certainly possible. Suzuran right through it, nice. Yeah, Suzuran probably has a burst bait as well. Yeah, that, that was a that was a necessary RC from Squid Guy, because that was gonna be a punish. Ooh. Oh mm. doesn't get punished for the blue burst. Arazami does it. I'm definitely not gonna miss Air Azami oh. in Strive. Suzu throw. Suzu throw. Uh, has now been uh, relocated to a, a Soul Bad Guy Super. Ooh, Ooh landed on the wrong side, or the, the other side. <laughs> yeah. Alright, good escape. And the oh. patience to not strike into the Azami. Why get the maximum value out of their combo? Oh, tries to beta burst again. <laughs> Alright. Being watchful, being ready, feel like trying to intercept any jump out from the corner from Squid Guy. This kitty has to be careful here. One hit. Oh, oh there's there a burst. Go. And there you go. Good read and chose to commit just enough to the burst bait to draw out the burst from Keskiri as well. Good stuff. The, the stale chat commentary, I like it. Bike and I think Squid Guy wants 
once told me that uh, he reacts to whether or not uh, his opponent um, IBs the uh, the chain and then acts accordingly. Yeah, that's that's actually smart as hell. That is, because like even even if you're minus, as long as you're not punishable, Biken is one of those characters who can still play RPS because of her one frame Azami into big rewards. Yeah. In, in that sense, kind of like Slayer, because uh, Slayer as well. If you're if you're not punishable, you can always try to backdash and then mm. do your yeah. wonky ass options that other yeah. characters can't. So as they say, you're only minus for a bitch. Yeah, for that that actually holds true for this kind of characters. Yeah. Okay. Bike and pressure somehow. Looking incredibly strong today. Yeah, the is this? there it is. If you don't IB, if you don't IB that Rock Konsogi, she's not punishable yeah. and she can play oh. Azami. Disgusting. Another really important move that Squid Kai probably watches out for as well is that Rock Konsogi. If they IB, you gotta spend the RC. Yeah. Unless you wanna get punished. Yeah, Keskidi's trying to set up projectiles and whatnot from full screen, and Squid Guy's just kind of running through it with the good old Suzuran. I don't know how, how well that's gonna work out in the long run. Alright, the heart rate on the jump out. Keskidi doesn't bite. Oh, the ball disappears just above him. Oh, tick throw. Yeah, Keskidi having troubles getting their game started. Squid Guy is being relentless. Yeah, it's it's been looking pretty dominant so far. Which is interesting because I I think uh, the last time I saw these two play, um, Keskidi might have won slightly. It was a challenger league. Might have also been Eskagas. I'm I, I keep confusing them. <laughs> All of these May players are one hive mind. Oh, that was a chip <laughs> kill. <laughs> so that means there was no way for Keskidi to punish that unless they get like a backdash out between the Sanzu hits? I, I don't think that's gonna work, no. So, yeah, if if, if he didn't have the... No, you, you can't even you can't even blitz it, no. That was... that was GG's. Get the insane guy. That's so much damage. Like, can still a very squishy character. Yeah, yeah see, IB. there you go. That, that's what you said. Uh, IB Rokon immediately gets off scene. Oh, look at that result! <laughs> I, think, I think it's dead. Oh, drop though. Oh. Yeah, I, I, I don't think Squid Lab did full risk combo like that. Yeah, it's kind of rare that you get an opportunity like that. For three counter hits? Wow. Yeah. Oh, and okay, it's bring especially bring fucked up because you kind of have to change your combo depending on whether you have enough risk to get like one, two, or three counter hits. Oh! <laughs> nice, backdashing the um, chain. What's it called again? I forgot. Alright, in the corner we go. Big opportunity for Keskiri to make stuff count. They really oh. love that, that like jump D as a as a sort of like yeah. a momentum switch, like yeah, sort to, of a base. Just to kind of stall for a bit. Yeah. The downside is it kind of does put you in a vulnerable position coming down. Yeah. If they don't bite. For sure. Oh, Ooh, was he ready? Blocking? Oh no! That's a very fast startup. Blitz, throw. Okay, I like that. Oh, nice! Gets a conversion despite that difficult position. That Very kills, good. Nice. Overhead kiss always delivers. Suzu throw. We all know it. Yeah, oh. there it is. It, it works so well. You wanna press? You wanna press? Show me your layer 2 option. Arrows on you. Oh, still doesn't get punished. 
I guess you're looking a little shook. Oh no! <laughs> yeah, that's a. Oh that's dead. no! Unless. Oh. oh blocking. Oh. <laughs> that JK. No. <laughs> you got prank. No, it's so lucky that he had the 75 meter there. Yeah. An extra, extra one for YRC. Go. <laughs> Showman. Okay, put him in the corner. Or not. Nice, the tatami catches the backdash. Here we go. Good backdash. Yeah, the tatami wasn't quite in range. Oof. Tetsuo, I see. Oh, but he's so ready. Using that beach ball as a weapon against Mei. Ooh. Oh. Okay, okay. <laughs> The empty 6k as a throw bait! 6k with the throw in the frames! Gets there the round! Yeah, that's that's often gonna be the problem with that corner route against uh, <clears throat> lightweights. It's, it's really, really hard to connect it. I think if you have... If you're willing to spend 5... Uh, sorry, if you're willing to spend 50 meter at the end, uh, it's fairly simple to just do like a free loop route and then just smack a super at the end. But meterless, it's gonna be a little <laughs> tricky. <laughs> and like the 6 H in neutral. Oh, the burst bait! It's a being a reset! Oh, overhead oh, kiss. I don't know, man. Yeah, just respect. Never mind. Left, right? Well, I don't think so. Oh. Oh, late burst. I like it. <clears throat> oh, but this Ooh. burst will be baited. This with burst doesn't get to confirm. It's so weird being, playing against Bike and because, like, even <laughs> if she's in the air, she could be Azamiing you. Yeah. You just gotta play a total different set of options as RPS. Yeah, yeah. You gotta. Pull yeah. out the grappler. Yo, that moves! That follow-up moves you so far! <laughs> oh, oh to, okay. Oh, you, I would simply counter hit the Azami follow-up, yes, of course. Ooh, good, almost a good hit. Yo, IAD straight into the 2D! Uh, Petsis was 5-1, I think. Yeah. Right, flying. Nice. Fighting that time. This is into the corner. Squid Kai. 75. Oh, okay. This will be close. Not quite. And Squid Kai will get their burst back here. Oh, Ooh, tries to go for something cheeky there. I think Squid Kai determined oh. that. <gasps> oh! And a good version! Yo, that's sick! Mm. Okay, doesn't get the full combo. Squid Kai lives. Squid Kai breathes. This is one hit oh. point. Is that overhead? Are you keeping the burst? No! Yeah, okay. <laughs> that's great, Azami, in that situation. You don't. As long as you Azami something, you don't end up taking the damage, so. Why not play? Why not play those parries? <laughs> oh, and again. again. There we go. Guess get in trouble. Hard bait. Oh my god. Oh, a little too trigger happy on the funky May buttons. Squid guy on the oh, burst. Oh, the burst. Of destroying oh. Kitty. Mm. It's looking so grim. It's looking so grim. Oh, I kind of like that. He, he got the IB, but didn't take the strike punish. And okay, instead doubled that up. <laughs> so close. Oh, he's just fishing for it. Oh, overhead kiss gets ruined by the beach ball. Oh, oh, oh. I mean, oh. There's, there's no reason for him to not do it, because Keskiri is not showing a punish. 
Oh, nice back dash. Gold burst. What even? It's so hard because Squid Guy keeps on being airborne. The conversion is hard. Oh, this is heartbreaking. Still no clean hit. It's gonna end with left. Arazami. I can smell it. It's just gonna end with Arazami follow up. Throw him. He tried oh, to. How did the air to... work? What? Oh, that's it. <laughs> Brilliant. That was too heavy. Dash. Overhead kiss into the too heavy. If that was even a couple of frames too late, that would have that would have been the set. Oh, uh, holy! How did the air throw not work there? I'm so confused. <laughs> he jumped past Squid with the JH out. Doesn't matter. We're on the board. All right, nice. Like the 2D option, very good at countering that Suzeran, which does not guard against Lowe's. <laughs> oh, oh, oh wrong, wrong direction! That's so <laughs> tragic! Guilty Gear took that combo away from Keskiri. Ah, oh, there you go. That's what you meant. Unfortunate drop on the overhead kiss. Uh oh, oh this is hurt. Oof. Okay, Keskiri still has some health to play with here. Good, 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 good. That's what we need. Jump out of the throws. Ooh. Ooh, that's a lot of risk. I think that's... Oh! Drops it? No, that's death. Yeah, good old 6k. <laughs> Throw in a... Don't press. Mm. Oh, he wants it. Yeah, I oh. saw that from a mile away. <laughs> ah. Oh, no. I wonder if this, at this point the play is Keskiri takes out the ball and then... Just hard reads that squid guy is going for it. But then again, what are, what are you... What are oh, you the reset! <gasps> what is this? Tries to beta burst. Doesn't get it. Guess kitty with the patience. Late burst, okay. Now what? Now what? JH. Oh uh, it's... Yo, he stands up and blocks the oh, instant overhead. But I look at this. Despair. Guess kitty with no life whatsoever. Squid guy has the burst even. This is... Almost impossible. They're playing Samsha now. Oh, <laughs> just one? Oh my god. <laughs> oh. What is this? What is any of this? Ooh, okay. Almost, almost impossible. That was such a funky conversion. But that doesn't mean completely oh, nice. impossible. Oh, yo, he dared. What? Wake up, TK Yozansen. Really? That's how we're feeling today? Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. I guess at the loss of uh, the legendary 7 1, <laughs> we're looking at more 5 1s now. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, wait, what character is this? Soul Bad Guy? Okay, DP. It's fine. His name's not Squid Bad Guy for nothing. <laughs> it, it is on, on the server. It's been this way for months. Okay. Okay. And we Still have. He's in. One more to go. In Stale Devil versus Centrion, the Soul Mirror. Stale promised me Funny the Eye. I want to see the delivery. As soon as I saw the card for this event, and looked at, oh, it's Stell, Devil, and Sentry, and I was like, ah, oh, shit, here we go again. If yeah. you, everybody who knows the track record for these two players can pretty much <laughs> predict that shit is going to go wild tonight. Like, we're, we're going to see dragon installs, we're going to see swinging for the fences, probably lots of ill-advised DPs, and probably even a IK or two. Stale is eagerly waiting on the cab. I mean, it is basically in his name. Dragon Install Research Association, I think. Uh, the, the Dragon Install uh, Recommendation Association. Oh, close enough. 
such a such a beautiful tag okay and here we have our player two i like the uh the ice soul and regular soul uh lobby avatars it's what we're all about and like centrion is not uh, is He's definitely not on the tame side of the soul spectrum either. It stands for dragon install right away. That's so boring. I thought it was the recommendation association. What is this? Come on. Alita asks Stale. Okay, Stale on the banana soul, the legendary. Centrion is also one of the players who has been on the tri guild gear spree pretty much playing acpr this and strive <laughs> at the same time simultaneously of course, uh, yeah oh about yes that. yes about that mm. today is a good day today's <laughs> this is roughly what i expected oh i wasn't ready yet <laughs> And it's it's not even 20 seconds into the set, and Stale is already in Dragon Install. I love this. <laughs> the double bringer. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, this is just beautiful. Oh, the cross up! <laughs> DP versus DP. The meta game who DPs last <laughs> will win. I like the DP for air stalling. You know, going over the gunflame with it. Okay. There you go. <laughs> oh my god. I like that punish what? if... I don't know if I can match this energy. <laughs> this is... I, I guess it's it's good that we played this set last, because this will drain all of your yes. mental energy. I, I will go right to sleep after this. This is literally... I, I'm getting exhaustion just by watching it. It's... <laughs> it's... Oh, he's in there! The soul players are draining Ooh. the energy of the universe to Stale. fuel the rage. Try to counter dunk it, but... Oh no. <laughs> oh, that's a 5 rage. It didn't work! Now looking for a way out, safely. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Ooh, Mr. Super Jump IAD. Oh, that was such a wack box. Okay. Okay. <laughs> So it's basically um, gonna be a combo exhibition. Both players, gentlemen, giving each other the best starters that they could ever wish for. Yes, of course. One at they, a time. They mutual, mutual six H providing. Okay. Oh, oh does it? <laughs> yeah. Of course not. Because why would he? Timing is a little strict. You can whiff that burst against uh, Grand Viper and get a true punish, but. Yeah. Alright. Oh no. <laughs> okay. This looks like Guilty Gear. Hang on. Oh no. Oh, you know no what mind. he's gonna do? Yep. No more Guilty Gear. Oh, the smart choice from Still. Woo! That was such a good pickup. The gorilla being like, I think this other gorilla smashed my face. Me counter. <laughs> That's so smart. Mm. <laughs> so bad guy do big hit. Oh no! <laughs> it wasn't even close. Oh my lord. Oh no! <laughs> okay, okay. Okay. Alright, RC for the road. Oh no. Oh wait, how did the <laughs> combo drop there? I don't, I have no clue. I'll oh, just whiff through the 6 feet. Oh, that's a decent starter. Into. Okay. Oh, Stale has it. Yep. Oh no. Kudakuro? Oh, Blitz? Yo, okay. Stale. Picks up from it. Oh no. Stale broke Stale. their ace cards for this matchup. I think that's, yeah, that's oh. <laughs> The secret weapon, the blitz. The secret weapon using an offensive tool. Is like, 
Of course, of course they would DP when they see the dragon insta. It's like, I don't want you to play. Oh I, my god. I, I like how, how they only uh, blitz during dragon install, though, because you lose the tension anyway when you get out. <laughs> tension outside of dragon install would be much better used on again, entering dragon install. Oh! Okay. <laughs> that was an unfortunate time to burst. <laughs> and now Stale gets to go pretty wild. Has meter for pretty much anything that he desires. Oh, he cancelled it! Oh, another one! Wait! Let me get that Stay straight. That was Dragon Install YRC into Dragon Install. No, he, he couldn't get the first Dragon Install out because of the Super Flash from Centurion's Dragon Install. So he, he tried to do DI YRC, but he only got the YRC because the DI input was eaten. Oh, I see, I see. By Sentry and Super Flash. So then he just DIs again afterwards. <laughs> for good measure. Man, only Soul players who've played the character for 10 plus years can understand the deep <laughs> layer of RPS yeah. happening here. Of course. Uh, the, the Astral Yomi going on right here. Like that. What, nice. Whatever that was. But. I mean, it ended up working and intercepting, so they I guess they know something we don't. I know nothing what these guys know. Same. I don't know how these guys' brains work. I'm just happy that they're happy. That was a good IB on Chump D. Having a good time. Alright, okay. time to dunk him. Ooh, that's nice! That was a full screen oh, corner carry. <laughs> <laughs> Again? Oh no! Oh my god. Ooh, good starter, yeah. There you go. Stale could have potentially tried to burst, but that was that was gonna be a risky one, so I can agree taking that burst into the next round. So that we can burst here? No! So we get RPS here! <laughs> Footsies. Oh, Ooh, that's a good one. And building meter as well. Okay. I wonder if that was a reset attempt. Oh, DPRC, the good old. The classic. Sentry on, meter oh, no. is available. <laughs> You've heard of air tech buttons, get ready for air tech DI. Oh, oh. what is this? <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Oh. That was actually uh -oh. good. Ooh, oh, can he no. change? No, oh, no. It's the confirm. Fail. Stale, what are you doing? Is he dying? No, still has one. Now he is. What is it? <laughs> no. No. <laughs> what? Encore. He's yes. Doing big punish. Catch him. Get his ass. There we go. <laughs> oh my god. And oh Sentry on. On the board. I don't know how. <laughs> I can't commentate on this play. I don't know what happened. But it happened. Uh, burn like the sun. Ooh! Good, good read. Damn, right? <laughs> it's been eight Did seconds, we... they both lost their burst. Oh! <laughs> S still losing on the DP oh. mash competition. Sentry Ooh. getting their cancel. Oh, oh, oh <laughs> accidentally cancelling the, the mortal counter. Okay, get your knockdown. Is that gonna... Yes. No! Oh no! <laughs> no! My life! Damn! Now that, now that I actually look at it, that heavy DP from Dragon Install from Sol actually moves forward quite a bit <laughs> compared uh, to the normal DP. Uh, it's, it's dash momentum. And not also uh, the IDP just moving higher uh, at the same at the same uh, angle makes it move further as well. As the counter hit DP, gives the ah, combo. almost double the stun. Uh oh, here you go. The dream starter. Oh no, never mind. What? What? Wait, what? Stay. Which side? Stay. Stay. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Gets out of the DI safe. And okay, here's the counter so DI. Is my turn. 
Oh, good ass pickup. Under? Yes! <laughs> oh my god. Oh. I think Stale might have might have recognized that Sentry and had a pretty decent position to attempt the chip kill there. And just committed into the Grand Viper. Maybe? Oh, oh not quite. Oh. Okay. Oh, this is two hit though. Yo, both players cancelling. Uh oh. Ooh. We got the combo. Okay. We'll take yes. that. Yes. That kills. <laughs> that, that looked really weird. That was probably. Maybe Stell didn't expect it to go quite like that, but. <laughs> at least. You have it's a decent. Positioning. Yeah, there's a decent amount of freestyle still available in Dragon Install, so. It's movement, I swear. Yes. Ooh, okay. Right, who would have expected the defeat? Right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Ooh, nice. Oh, drops it. Lines up clipping. And here we go. Dunk him. This will go into the other corner. Unless. It's a reset! Oh. <laughs> Okay, get your knockdown. No, he doesn't Another even reset. go for it. He doesn't even go for it. He doesn't want it. Getting a reset would mean running Oki, okay, and that would mean less whatever this is. I'm surprised there wasn't a stun there for all of those resets. Then again, like if, <laughs> if, if any of those starters was a counter hit, that would have probably been it. Yeah, I'm not even. Alright, barely missing the air throw. Alright, show me your best combo. Yeah, this one. Just take him to the corner. That's the best combo. That's, that's, that's yeah, it's, it. it's like, if you if you have no meter, that's probably the best combo for mid-screen. Yes. Soul doesn't get the, the greatest ground confirms. Uh oh. 100 available. For Ooh, Centrion. he gets the, the side switch. He was so shook. What, what was that? He did a move. He missed the, the fashion for it, maybe. I don't know. Oh, BP. What, well, you were safe? Oh, he's stunned. I can't? No. No, I can't. And it's like one of the trickiest thing when you actually use the Invuls of Dragon Install activation to dodge something. I think Sentryon just barely dodged the active frames of Fafnir there. <laughs> okay, both players. 100. Here we go. <laughs> Who's gonna oh. flinch? Oh, wait, it knocks out of the corner. You! Yes! No. Input battle. Another one! Who's Keep gonna the input first? Who's gonna run oh, out of the was... Oh, wait. they're both. <laughs> <laughs> no, I can't. I just can't with these guys. <laughs> I was like, that was so smart for Stale not to cancel into the DP, but then they both get stunned. <laughs> oh, okay. Just can't buy it, but it's fine. It's fine. Oh, more. More! More! <laughs> mm, give me all that you got! Is that shit all? Not quite oh, does it quite? Okay, Stale's turn. Nobody's turn. Oh, that's a chip. Oh no. <laughs> yeah. Even if Sentry they tried something there. Even if they block that, that's that's good night. There's nothing they could have done. Uh, I, I I saw a DP start up on on uh, Central side there. Alright, <laughs> delicate position. Stale Devil is on set point here. Oh. What? <laughs> nice! Cancel on the clash on the second hit. Good reactions. That's too much. Oh, oh, oh no! no. Good no. idea though. Into the other corner with you. Ooh. Knock him down. Okay. Oh, okay. 
Son. I'm crying. Oh, no. nice. Wait, that was so smart. I, if I was sentry on, I was like, yeah, there's no way Stella is gonna burst. But he knew. He knew. It must be soul players think alike. <laughs> But still not out of the woods yet. Centrion has to win this round to stay alive. Oh, that works. <laughs> Semblance of composure. Nice reaction. Well, that's Ooh. a counter hit as well. Gets a full combo. Yeah. Has the meter. Hit. That's, that's it. GG's. Stale Devil Soul. When the you come... Soul. When you come at the king of wild, you better be sure you don't miss. <laughs> oh, the burning sun. <sighs> okay. <laughs> so that was that. Oh, my um, goodness. 